I think there's different sort of dimensions to it. There's the one that, are you really ready and open? Is your heart ready and open? Well, hello, we are in Costa Rica. And this is Rogelio, he's gonna tell us a little bit about his experience while being here. So, hello Rogelio, how's everything so hello, far? Hello, I'm muy bien. Everything's going well, thank you. What was going through your mind when you were watching the videos or watching some pictures and what was happening for you, like in order for you to say, okay, I'm gonna go to, to Costa Rica? Well, it was clear. I mean, there are beautiful women in different parts of the world and different countries, but it was clear that just sending letters back and forth really wasn't going to move really close to a relationship, at least not for me. So I thought, you know, I just want to go out there and, and, and uh, not have any high expectations, just meet some people and just enjoy the uh, trip. So what was happening or what do you think, like the first time that you actually went into the first social and you got to see so many ladies? Yeah, it was certainly helpful that the prior videos sort of you know gave me just a, a little bit of an introduction that you know there would be so many ladies uh it's different in real life obviously uh, it's just a little overwhelming but um i think you just have to be yourself you know and just just go with the moment and and have fun and you did have fun because i was watching you like the, at the socials you were you know you were doing very well for yourself and at the social, in each table, we have some feedback papers. So the ladies were giving you their, you know, their contact information that they wanted. So that means that they were also uh, attracted to you. So what was for you like getting that kind of response from so many ladies? And what do you think about them bef uh, before coming? Do you think that they were going to be like so friendly, so nice, so beautiful? So the first table was for me kind of a disaster because I was so nervous, um, didn't quite have a rhythm, uh, didn't quite have a, a good plan. Even the whole Friday night, uh, it got better as, as we went along. Uh, Saturday was really just out of the park. I had a great time because I was already used to what was going to happen. Yeah, you know, such a great response. and. The challenge for me was uh, just trying to filter through all the interest to try to find out, you know, stay focused on why I was here. But it certainly, you know, you feel like uh, like a movie star, like a king. I mean, it's just, it's amazing the uh, the attention, the service, the um, the kindness of the people, especially the women. So you got to spend a little more time with some of the ladies. So what can you tell us about, you know, now that you have able to, uh, that you were able to spend some time with them? You know, there's an interesting dimension to all of this is because you're with some other man and everyone has their own sort of idea on what they want to do. Um, personally, my goal was to sort of filter through names and, and try to just get a better understanding. So yeah, I've gone on a, a couple of dates and they were extremely enjoyable. Uh, and it's Tuesday today. Uh, we had the social just a few days ago. If you, I mean, you really want to stay here. Uh, if, you, if you do start feeling some connections, the days fly by. Uh, and so I'm glad that I'm staying till Sunday. I'm staying a little longer and I also came a little earlier. But just, just to answer your question, yeah, it's been great. The, the women that I've met have uh, been very respectful and uh, open, honest, and it's been a great experience. So do you think that they are here at the agency because they actually want to find the right one? The women that I have uh, met outside of the social absolutely they they are serious and and it's it's a little frustrating for many of them um in that you know they they would like for that connection to happen a little little sooner in their life but very patient waiting for the right one yes i, I think they're very serious and and honest about their intentions
you know a little bit of Spanish, but do, do you think that it was like a problem if you didn't know anything at all? Like, do you think like the ladies wouldn't be able to communicate with you or or what was your experience like that? No, that's a good question. So I had a lot of fun, you know, speaking terrible Spanish and having a lot of laughter with it and saying the wrong words, etc. Um, my interpreter was amazing. She was just uh, amazing, awesome. And I did pay attention to, I think of all the men that came, maybe I think one or two others spoke some Spanish, but the others didn't at all. And they've just had a great time. So clearly my experience has been great in terms of the possible gap in communications, but it seems the same even with the men who, who don't speak Spanish. It seemed like it was a great, uh, they were able to communicate. If anyone is watching this video and they are still hesitating or they just don't know if they they should do this kind of tours with AFA to Costa Rica or to any of our, our locations that we have for tours, what will you tell them? I think there's different sort of dimensions to it. There's the one that, are you really ready and open? Is your heart ready and open? Um, and the other one is uh, the money, you know. I mean, you try to try to piece together, you know, the funding and expense money while you're here. So if that's not an issue, then I don't know what you're waiting for. If, if it is a money situation, then yeah, you know, take your time. And you don't want to come out here and worry about, um, you know, trying to not spend money because you know, you might want to go to a restaurant, you might want to go on a trip, you want to have a little pocket change. So, so again, the dimensions are, if you're ready and you have an open heart and, and uh, you're already looking for beautiful um, Latina woman, absolutely, get out here, it's the best way. And if you, the money's not an issue, then I don't know what you're waiting for. can experience the romantic adventure of a lifetime. Join men from all over the world as they take a trip and find their future brides. Check out our website at costa-rica-women.com If you enjoyed this video, be sure to give us a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel. Then click on the notice bell to get notified every time we add something new.